You are now watching The Pearl Poppy. What's up, YouTube? Que lo que? My name is Christian Ramos, and I'm the one, the only, The Curl Poppy. And today, we're going to be showing you everything that I got at the Hue Hair Affair. Because, baby, when I tell you I came back with six bags worth of products, hold up. Let's say that one more time. When I tell you I came back with six bags worth of products, this is gonna be a long video and make sure that you catch the video that was uploaded right before this one, which actually shows you me going through the Hue Hair Affair and I have interviews with a bunch of like CEOs of different hair brands and different small companies. And you just get to see all of the fun and litness that we had because when I tell you that the Hue Hair Affair was lit, baby, it was lit. But anyway, so, this video is going to be rather long, so make sure you grab uh, something to drink and stay hydrated, a little snack. And uh, just want to warn you guys from the get-go, I am a little lit myself because I have been drinking. I have been drinking. Yeah, I've been drinking. But anyway, so the Hue Hair Affair, I went with one of my best friends. Her name is Curlise. You guys seen her in my Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram, you should be following me on Instagram. But anyway, um... I went with Curlise, met up with one of my really good friends. Her name is Iggy. She goes with me all the time to like different hair events. She went with me last year. And it was honestly just a vibe. Like literally, it was such a vibe. All right, guys. So look, this is all we got at the Hue Hair Affair. Like literally six bags worth of stuff. I think I'm going to go from the smallest to the biggest. Actually, we're going to we're gonna start off with the goodie bag from the actual Hue Hair Affair. This is what you got with your ticket if you bought the VIP ticket, which was $40. They also had general admission, which was $20. And then for the first 200 people that were at the event and waiting online, they actually got a separate goodie bag. It wasn't this one. It wasn't a little bougie one like the VIP, but they did get a goodie bag with full-size products in it. My friend Iggy actually was one of the first 200 people and she did end up getting a goodie bag. I went through it and made sure I was like, listen, if all I had to do was wait online and get the same goodie bag, so I made sure I looked in her bag to make sure she didn't have the same stuff that I had, even though, listen, I'm a hater like that, so no, I'm kidding, I'm not a hater. But I did wanna see what product she did get in her goodie bag. And anyway, right now I'm rambling, so let's just get right into the video, because this is gonna be a long one. Like, literally, it's gonna be long as hell. Okay, so the first thing that we have is, well, I didn't even really, like, get to dig through this. But I already see that there is a lot of stuff in here. And the first thing that we have is going to be... Oh, this is cute. So this is a notebook that we got. A little cute character in the front. Uh, be Rooted in Culture and Reflect. So this is from the company Be Rooted. Uh, their website is www.berooted.co.com. And yeah, literally, lead with passion. This is so cute, mad cute. I can uh, write some video ideas on this book. So the next thing in the goodie bag is from Cream of Nature. They were actually not selling any product, but they were doing live demos and displaying all of their new products that they had. So everybody knows there. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, a little edge brush. I'm gonna be using that for my beard because I don't have edges. But this is cute because you already know I'm Dominic I'm that Dominican poppy, so I'll be getting a little taper cut. So I don't really have edges. But this is cute. I'm definitely gonna be using this for my beard. Mad cute. Everybody knows Cream of Nature's original line. So from their original line, which is the Argan Oil um, collection, we have a blowout cream. I'm not gonna use this because I don't blow my hair, but great that they added that. I'm gonna give it to my sister. They gave the Moisture and Shine Curl Activator Cream. I've actually used this uh, activator cream. It's really good. The only thing is, I'm not a fan of the smell of the original line from Cream of Nature, uh, but it is, it is good. I like it, but the smell, I just can't get down with it. Uh, they gave us a Pure Honey Food Hair Curl Defining Cream. Love that. They gave us a butter blend and a flaxseed double duty detangling and slip rinse out and leave in conditioner. This is from their new line. I haven't tried it out just yet. They also gave us a curl creator pudding. This is a pure honey coconut oil shea butter plus banana. Ooh, I don't know if I want to eat this or put it in my hair. 
but I'm excited to try this out. And then they gave us, this is also from their new line, I believe. This is their acai berry line. This is a detang, uh, listen, I can't even read. Remember, I said I was tipsy. Uh, this is a damage prevention hair mask. Pure honey, coconut oil, shea butter, acai berry. Yes. And then, oh, this is a, this is an extra firm hold uh, edge gel. So the next thing in the goodie bag we have from Honey Baby. If you watched the video that I uploaded right before this, again, listen, there's gonna be a promo for the video before this. But if you watched the video right before this, you do get to see that I was able to interview the CEO of this brand. She also owns Botanica Beauty, which I have up here in my beauty supply store. Uh, but this is going to be the Not My Honey Instant Detangler. Smells amazing. I have smelled this product. I haven't used it. Excited to put a review. And then we also got the Hold It Honey Styling Gel. Actually, I want to smell it on camera because... Oh, listen. When it comes to Botanica and the Honey Baby... There's one thing they're going to get right, and it is the scent. Like, their scent. <sighs> Love it. So, the next product in the goodie bag is going to be from Mish. They were also one of the vendors there. I had so much fun interviewing the CEO of Mish as well. She was she was hilarious. She was a good time. Uh, and then also the people that were working the booth with her. Listen, we just had a ball at Mish. Like, me and my best friend, Curlise, we was having... A ball at me but this is gonna be the curl defining mousse uh, I have not used any Mish products before so I am excited to have this I do have other Mish products you'll see later on in the video uh, but this is just specifically what was in the goodie bag so if I'm not mistaken Shea Moisture was the main sponsor of the Hugh Hair Affair this year last year was Palmer's this year was Shea Moisture but they gave us the Jamaican black castor oil plus flaxseed strong hold styling gel uh, you can't go listen I know there's levels to hair care. People start off with Cantu, then move on to Shea Moisture, and then they branch off into other ones. And you just can't go wrong with Shea Moisture. I love Shea Moisture. I have not used any of their hair gels ever, uh, but I, obviously I've used their hair mask and their like curling puddings and all that other good stuff, but I've never used one of their gels. And uh, wow, it's funny because you smell the black castor oil, but, uh, it has like a like something added into it that the, that doesn't smell like pure cast Jamaican black castor oil because listen if you watch any of my other videos I love 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 the Shea Moisture Jamaican black castor oil mask and the leave-in conditioner so I am excited to try this out as well. Palmer's was also in the house and they gave me a Shine Therapy shampoo, uh, Jamaican black castor oil, and then they gave us. Like a little packet this is the shampoo that they gave us full size and they gave us a little packet with a um moisture boost two-step mask Ooh, so one's a deep conditioning mask and one is a protective glaze so i'm excited to try these out listen i just want to say if you ever go to any hair event and palmer's is there they, they are going to give you full size products when i went last year if you watched the video from last year of the goodie bag they 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 really did it up. They did it up and not to disappoint this year again. So this I was excited to take a look at, but again, Cream of Nature was not selling anything. Oh, but wow, this smells amazing. I was, <laughs> listen, I was in love with the color purple and this is from Cream of Nature. It is a damage prevention 24 hour nourishing cream oil for protection before, during, and after protective styles. So I am excited to try this out. Smells amazing, it's purple. You can't go wrong. So this is a tea tree premium hair oil from Defeel. Defeel, I don't know, listen, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but it's different feel and they put different and feel together and it's pronounced Defeel, I don't know, maybe. But this is a hair oil that they gave us. Uh, and listen, this might be in a giveaway because I am not the biggest fan of hair oils. Me and hair oils, we got beef. And uh, yeah, this might just go in a giveaway. <sighs> Listen, I'm hot. That liquor is kicking in. Mm. Ooh, okay, so this is Pro Strength Urban 
skit urban ugh. so this is pro strength urban skin rx this is a sheer glow even tone daily defense mineral moisturizer with uh spf oh and it has 11.6 percent zinc oxide this i am excited to try out because urban skin rx is uh it's one of those popping brands for the skin and the fact let me see how big this is but the fact that we got a moisturizer with spf baby oh okay let's go packaging you see that iridescent yes can't wait to try this this is from eden body works this is the coconut shea leave-in conditioner i have not tried a lot of eden body works products but what i will say they have one of the most popping most popping co-washes it's the i believe it's the coconut co-wash um the girl that was working the booth at eden body Works, she actually told me that it's right now in back order um they are not selling it right now because they have been having issues like many other companies uh manufacturing some of their products but listen if they can get it together with their manufacturers that co-wash amazing but this right now is the leave-in conditioner excited to try this out because if it's anything like the co-wash i know that this is gonna give me that slip and bounce that i need so this product is from lip bar it is a lipstick uh it's vegan cosmetic beauty for all shades obviously i don't wear makeup so i'm not gonna use this probably gonna give this to my sister or put it in a giveaway who knows let's see if she likes it herself oh okay all right Clearly, I've never bought lipstick because I don't know how to open this. All right, let's see. Oh, the packaging is really cute. Look at the packaging. Mad cute. Okay, this is the color. Obviously, again, I'm not going to wear it. Oh, look, look, look. It got a little lip there, and then it says lip bar. Uh, this is real cute. Uh, kudos to the packaging because the packaging is super, 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 super cute. Uh, does it say the shade of this one? No, I don't see the shade anywhere, but uh, yeah, this is from Lip Bar. And then last but not least for this goodie bag, we got some little tchotchkes. I don't know what brand this is, but they gave us a little pin. Uh, oh my God, this brand was so cute. They actually make, um, we made a fun joke about it being a charcuterie board, uh, but this is Trey's Lunchbox. They are so cute. Check them out on Instagram or in the previous video. I actually got to show off their products. Super cute, super, super cute. Um, book your tour. What's this? Beauty school is calling. So this is a, oh, this is like an Aveda beauty school card. Um, know what you're made of. This is another Aveda sticker. And then Shea Moisture gave us a wash wealth repeat. So I'm assuming this is a pamphlet. Yes, it definitely is a pamphlet uh, showing you how to take care of your hair, use their products, all that good stuff, that literature. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, I lied. There was one more product inside of the goodie bag. This is from Aveda. This is a foot relief moisturizing cream. Intensely moisturizes, smooths, and ooh. Okay. This is for your feet. I generally do not use lotion. Ooh, smells good. But I don't use lotions that are specific to body parts. So um, this is probably gonna go in a giveaway also. All right, I don't think you understand how hot I am. I'm sweating bullets. Like I'm really sweating bullets right now. And that was bag number one. Let's move on to bag number two. So this, uh, I actually was given to by the cream of nature people that were at the Bufa Cream of Nature. And again, I saw it, I was like, it's purple, smells amazing. And then I got so let down because they weren't selling anything. And the girl was like, listen, curl puppy, just take it, put it in your bag. I'm not, I didn't see you. And I was like, well, what are you talking about? She's like, just put it in your bag, just put it in your bag. And uh, I'm so grateful that she did give me this, but this is a leave in treatment. Uh, and this is from their acai berry line. So I am excited to try this out. Uh, Eating Body Works was giving out this refresher, which I'm gonna put on right now because when I tell you that I'm literally burning up and I was actually hot at the event, but, mm. oh, this is refreshing. 
but this is an uh, this is a refresher for hair and body. Ooh, let me put on my hair. Let, let me put some on my hair. Mm. But instantly, I feel cooler. Mm. Listen, I was mad hot at the event and I'm kind of upset because my hair was looking flat and limp. And right now it's giving what I wanted it to give at the event and I just felt like it was not giving at all. But um, um listen. We still the curl poppy, we cute. So next up we have Pink Root, and shout out to Pink Root because she showed me mad love. As soon as she saw me, she was like, I recognize you, the curl poppy. Uh, she follows me, I follow her back. Uh, so she showed me mad love and gave me a bunch of products. Um, and the first one that we have here is gonna be the Pink Root Leave-In Conditioner. We also have the uh curl styling paste wait actually let me smell this paste because oh it's pink it's literally pink and it smells florally oh i love it um what else we got here uh we also have the curl enhancing lotion we also have oh these are samples okay so these are smaller ones and uh, this is going to be the leave-in conditioner, the curl enhancing lotion, and the curl styling paste. So literally, she gave me full-size products and she gave me samples. Shout out to Pink Root. Next up, we have Camille Rose. I don't even know where I'm gonna put all this stuff because you already see Camille Rose takes up an entire shelf in my beauty supply and literally love them i didn't i didn't buy anything at camille rose because if you don't know your boy has done three campaigns with them and uh they always hook me up they always show me love so i am very very grateful to camille rose and uh they pay well as well but anyway uh they gave me a bunch of samples uh i can't i only got two hands so we're gonna do this one by one also i was kind of mad because they sold out of the curl maker so fast. Like literally by the time I got to their booth, I was I literally wanted to go and get curl maker and they were sold out of the curl maker. So all of you that were there and bought the curl maker, I would say some bad words to so yeah, but you know, that would make me look like a hater. And plus I have some there, but anyway, I'm so mad I wanted to get stuff from Camille Rose because everything was $5. No, everything was $10, my bad. Everything was $10. And if you know, the curl maker's $22. So if I could get it for half off, well, actually, I could just reach out to somebody and they could send me some. But anyway, I could have bought it myself for $10. For the price of one, I could have bought two and have curl maker forever. Uh, but they did give me curl maker, curl maker. They gave me the moisture milk. Uh, let's see what else we have. Oh, she gave me more. Oh, she hooked me up with Curl Maker. So she gave me more Curl Maker, more Curl Maker, and then some more Curl Love Moisture Milk. So, yes, damn. I still ended up getting my Curl Maker. So for all of y'all that bought the Curl Maker and they didn't leave the Curl Poppy some Curl Maker, I still got some. But we have the do, and they were actually giving this out in the entrance, and if you were wearing this around your neck, you were able to choose between their foam and this honey curl custard. I ended up choosing the honey curl custard. And it's funny because uh, one of my friends that, I, that used to work with me was actually one of the models at the do, and I was not recognizing her because she lost so much weight. So shout out to Dash because baby, you were looking amazing. Like she lost so much weight. She was dolled up. I was not recognizing her. She was waving at me and I was like, oh yeah, one minute, one minute. I thought she was trying to bring me to the booth to buy some stuff and it ended up being Dash. So uh, Dash, I love you girl and you look amazing. But anyway, we have the B-Girl Honey Curl Custard from The Doom. So they were selling these, right? And the girl, not my friend Dash, but one of the girls that was at the booth, we would, listen, whenever I go somewhere, I'll be having a kiki with everybody, right? I'm just the life of the party. And she was like, yo, you want this? And this is actually a, like a tube. So like, a, like um, let me show you, let me show you. But anyway, she said, you want this? And I was like, girl, if you're gonna give it to me, just give it to me. I ain't gonna say no. I don't say no to free stuff. So this is uh, one of those tubes that you can actually 
uh, style your hair. I'm obviously I'm not gonna mess up the curls right now, but you could do like different styles with your hair. Uh, you could use this as like a mask, a scarf, but this is really intended for your hair. It's really stretchy and soft material, and uh, it has a cute little design. This is, if anybody knows the do, this is the design of the do. And uh, shout out to the do for like hooking me up with this for free, and I didn't have to pay for it. And now we have Honey Baby. Even though y'all saw this in the main goodie bag, I was able to get some more products from Honey Baby. And honestly, shout out to the creator of Honey Baby. She is the sweetest. She had such a long conversation with me. You guys were able to see a short snippet of it in the previous video and listen, she was like, listen, just take these. I'm like, no, 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 no. Let me buy them, let me buy them. She's like, no, no, no. We love you, we support you. You can have these two. So I have two more of the uh, Hold It Honey Styling Gel and the Not My Honey Instant Detangler. Shout out to the owner of Honey Baby. She also owns Botanica. I love you, thank you so much. I appreciate you. So Shea Moisture, this is the bag that they were giving out. Uh, you actually didn't have to buy anything. All you had to do was take like a survey. They had a QR code, you scan it, it takes you to the survey. And they ended up giving us a full size product of the Defining Styling Gel. Uh, this is the Coconut and Hibiscus Flaxseed Styling Gel. And then what they also have in here, what else they got in here? Oh, and then they gave us a, uh, a packet of the raw shea butter deep condition, no, deep moisturizing mask with C. Kemp. I can't even talk anymore. I can't even talk. Uh, this is with C. Kelp and Argan oil. What's wrong with me? I need sleep and water. Okay, listen, when I tell y'all that Palmers be showing out at these hair events, it was literally grab as many as you could. The, it don't matter how many you wanted to take. And I got a bunch of uh, these packets. Uh, ooh, all right, all right, listen, a bunch of them. Let's break down what they are. So the green ones are gonna be a deep conditioner, which is the Moisture Boost plus Tahitian mana. Listen, I ain't even gonna try to pronounce that last word, but this is what it looks like. And then the orange and white is gonna be the length retention plus biotin is the length retention shampoo and the and the length retention conditioner. I'm losing it, guys. I'm literally losing it. All right, guys, we're down to the wire, and this is from me. I listen. I had a good time with everybody that was there, but when I tell you the people from Mish and the creator of Mish, the owner, listen, Michelle, you were a ball girl, but they gave me another curl defining mousse, but what I'm really excited about is the Peaches and Cream Limited Edition Conditioner, baby. If anybody knows anything about Mish, this deep conditioner only comes out for the holiday season. And anytime I've ever tried to get my hands on it, I've never been successful. It always sells out. Oh, smells so good. I can't wait to put this in my hair because I have been, for the last two years, I've been trying to get my hands on the Peaches and Cream Limited Edition hair mask. And I'm so excited that I got it. Oh, I love you. Well, I don't know yet. I don't know if I love you. But I do love the people at me. So if it's everything that I've heard about, I know I'm going to love it. Because the people, the energy, I know I know they put love into this. They had to put their elbow into this hair mask. Uh, but I'm excited to have it. All right, guys. So that was it. That was, listen, that's a lot of hair product. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it. Stay tuned. I might be doing a giveaway. Who knows? If I do, I'm going to announce it on Instagram. So make sure you're following me at the curl pop because you know, you already know I'll be posting some fleeky pics out here. Um, but if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below if you've ever been to the Hue Hair Affair event. Uh, if you've been to any other hair events and expos, which are some of your favorite. I know this year they postponed, well, they canceled, not postponed, they canceled Curl Fest once again. Um, that, that's always the highlight of my summer. So I'm, I'm happy that we were able to get the Hue Hair Affair uh, because events like this, they're just, 
they're just a vibe like you get to meet up with friends you meet cool people you get to network and honestly like i'm gonna be going next year and every year after that and hopefully i'll continue to get a bunch of free products well honestly the goodie bag wasn't free i paid 40 dollars, but everything else i didn't pay for nothing so shout out to all of you guys that showed me mad love everyone that i was able to meet over there like i made so many great connections um but honestly like loved it loved it loved it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time guys bye <laughs>